Aloha, I'm Tulsi Gabbard. When I came home from my second deployment to the Middle East, as soon as I stepped off the plane and felt those sweet trade winds caressing my face, and finally got to hold my family in my arms, I felt an indescribable and overwhelming joy. But at the same time, I also felt a very deep sadness for my brothers and sisters in uniform who were still in combat, far away from their own families, and for our heroes who would never have the chance to come home because they made that ultimate sacrifice for our country. That sadness is still with me, and it's why I'm determined to do whatever I can to ensure that our troops not remain in Afghanistan for a single day longer than absolutely necessary. That's why today, on this 10th anniversary of the war in Afghanistan, I'm calling for the immediate, safe, and orderly withdrawal of American troops from that country. It's time to bring our troops home to the loving embrace of their families. We achieved our original goal of entering Afghanistan. We've killed bin Laden, decimated Al-Qaeda in Afghanistan, and given the Afghan people the opportunity to have a democratic country if they choose. It's now time for the Afghan people to take responsibility for their own country. We cannot afford to be policing and nation building in foreign countries at a time when our own nation's infrastructure is crumbling. Our people are in dire need of work and our military is spread far too thin. We've been in Afghanistan now for 10 long years. Over 1,700 of our patriotic troops have sacrificed their lives and thousands more have been seriously wounded or lost their limbs. Every single week, we're spending more than $2 billion in Afghanistan alone. So the question facing us is not whether we can afford to leave, it is can we afford to stay? I say we cannot. Now is the time to bring our troops home.